Hi everyone, this is a video unboxing for the game 5 Minute Chase. Why an unboxing? Well, whilst this is out of strength and you might think, well, where's there a story here? Why do I want someone to punch some boards? I happen to have been trading with this guy, Dave Neal. He's after some things I've been having and very keen to provide me with something. I've been looking into this game for a while and I've seen UK Games Expo. I've never had a chance to play it. Curious, I've heard a couple of different things about it, which I'll get on to. It's also by Board and Dice, who I've been recording and doing some videos for Sierra West. And um, Dave Neal is very interested in Sherlock. He has even done the Sherlock Unlock game. Why is that of importance? Because I'm going to do another video later, also from Board and Dice, funny enough. Not by him, I believe. But um, also touches on a kind of potential unlocky, escape the room kind of thing. So... That's why it's unboxed, because Dave has signed this copy of the game. So, what's this game about? It's chasing, and all we're going to be doing now is punching out these things and having a look. Why punch them out and uh, just not get on with the game? Well, I might take this with me, as I'm going to be away in Germany when you're probably seeing this. I'm likely to be doing it at that point in time. And, uh, yeah, very big tiles. These are not on sized tiles. They're probably about four times as big, twice as wide. And, um, no, I know you need to be going to usually, I think, three locations, trying to do three different things, taking a turn each, so you're going to have the cops, and then you're going to be like the robbers, and, uh, no, very interesting theme, there's another game out, similar-ish, it sounds like, um, I think it's called Getaway or something like that, uh, I think that's been well received, and I'm very keen to try that out too, um, I think the company, or someone, the direction of this game Changed slightly from what, um, at least what Dave told me, compared to what I was thinking about playing this game as to how many moves people get. Otherwise, I think only one side typically wins. But I haven't tried out yet, and I don't know, depending on the opponent, you know, how equal um, players are for that to occur. So, these are the locations you go to. As you can see, it's quite a few, and that's of interest because it just gives a bit more variety, I guess, as to what you're trying to do. Good, it comes with bags, um, which um, Sierra West didn't have enough of, which is a bit of a shame. Ooh. I think that comes away fine. Uh, maybe it is better to punch. No, I think it's punching forward. So I think the big square ones, you had to punch the other way, uh, back to front. These are front to back. And yeah, smallish kind of box. I might take this to Germany uh, because I think some people are not going to be around. So a two-player game is always nice. This is going to go in a two-player playlist. And it be interesting to see how well I got on with it. And of course, anybody who wishes to play it as well. So that's the game. Three bags. This is interesting. I don't know I need three. Um, I'm going to use one of these big tiles, hopefully, because then I might not have to carry the box with me. Although I do need the rule book. So I may end up taking the box after all. Um, oh, might be bring back some games from Germany too, depending on if things can arrive and all the rest, and uh, what is out there, what's on sale as well, because I did manage to pick up some games out there before, so just knock them out, very glad it was half price, and I might even get it again if it's half price still, as um, all those score pads have gone, so those, oh, they might not all fit in here. I'm trying to keep some uh, commentary going because I've got a bread maker mixing some dough for pizza later. So I'm trying to keep that covered. But I like the idea of if it's five minute chase, is that a five minute game? Um, on the box, it says eight plus two to four. Interesting. And five to 15 minutes. So I wasn't aware you could play it with more players. So. It's another option, try it out at different player counts. So Dave um, happens to live, I won't give the exact location right now, um, in fact I happen to know his exact location, um, but lives um, close-ish, or he happens to be in the same neighbourhood in the sense of play testing on a regular basis with Brett J. Gilbert. So that's somebody else who I've mentioned in the past and someone who may well have already played this game, I'm not sure. I haven't seen if He's mentioned any kind of uh, thanks or anything like that. I don't know how familiar they are, but I believe they have had contacts or 
they at least know each other. Um, but yeah, so far the art looks quite nice. It's very clean looking pieces here. Um, and I think they are, so you've got plus you've got triangles and X's, you've got stars, basically same as the side, but gold and silver. And then you've got these squares and stars, but five-sided stars. So maybe these six-sided ones are shields or some kind of police base requirements. So all packaged away. Doesn't fly away. And um, got some variants, sounds interesting. Ah, and then the rule book. Oh, Paul Grogan did this, another person who I know. So very interesting to try another one of his games. I played um, Tides of Madness, uh, which he did the rule book for. And um, yeah, very keen to try out this. Brett J. Gilbert um, may have mentioned, I don't think I have, that he um, used to be an editor, which is why all his rule books are very quick for me to read and understand, which is great. But that all goes away. Um, obviously a little bit of space there to uh, carry stuff. I don't know how big an area it can be, because when I'm on a plane tomorrow, which won't be when you're seeing this, I don't know much space it's going to take up. Let's move that up a bit. So, the weight. Going on a plane, will it carry me much? I don't think it's going very heavy. 200, 385. And adding these on two. There we go. So this can all go in the bin and the recycling. That was five minutes chase. So if you like that video, um, please keep an eye out and check out when the actual how to play the video comes about, how to set up, play and review. And if you haven't already, you can hit the subscribe button to catch that. Um, videos are normally uploaded in an evening in the UK. Uh, hit the like button if you like this as well. And finally, if you have any comments, put them in the YouTube bits below. But that is 5 Minute Chase, and I hope you enjoyed that, and yeah, more videos are coming soon. So any mistakes, I'll put them in the description, but as it's an unboxing, I can't see what I'll do there. Take care, cheers then, next time, bye bye.